Last year, we told you about Men's Fitness Magazine naming Nick Ferroni one of the world's 25 fittest men. But now this Union High School history teacher has made an even more prestigious list. Naturally, this former soap actor is still working on his physique, but now the time he devotes to working with kids is being recognized by celebrity photographer John Russo. He's compiled a list called 100 Making a Difference, consisting of people, many internationally famous, making a difference in the world. I almost wanted to say no because of the company I'm in, but it's nice to say on your list with uh, Prince Edward, Michelle Obama, Mark Wahlberg, I mean some of the biggest names, so it's definitely a nice honor. And while he's most passionate about teaching, Ferroni, of course, still dabbles in television on the side and in Asbury Park, News 12 New Jersey, getting this exclusive look at a new TV project he's working on here involving, yes, fellow union native Artie Lang, the highly popular comedian formerly of the Howard Stern Show, doing a spoof on the bathing suit band that until recently was on the books in Asbury. Hello, sweetie. I have to arrest you. Is that a bathing suit? You can't have you on that. Somebody cuff her. Uh, Nick is a guy I know from my hometown, Union, New Jersey. I knew his older brother really well, and uh, you know, through that, we became friendly. And he's uh, in show business as well as a teacher, which is kind of unique. And he asked me to uh, do some stuff with him. So that's what we're here doing today. Meanwhile, Lang now co-hosts a sports talk show with comedian Nick DiPaolo called Nick and Artie, heard on the web and on satellite radio. And since Artie is such a sports nut, we just had to get his take on what else? Tim Tebow, who as you probably know, claims to be a virgin. Of course, the opinions expressed are those of Artie Lang and not those of News 12 New Jersey. Yeah, I think Tebow is a weirdo. I don't see how a guy who looks like a movie star and is a quarterback is not getting how do you not have sex? It's kind of odd. I mean, it's like, um, it, it really, I think there should be an investigation. I think something, we're going to find out some weird stuff coming out of the Tebow camp. <laughs> he is too much. You know, after attempting suicide a while back, well publicized, Artie says he is now enjoying life. In November, he's got his second book out. The last one was a big bestseller. It's called Crash and Burn. Talks about his recent struggles, but so popular here in so New Jersey. So all over, and it's good to see him making a comeback. Absolutely. And it certainly hasn't lost a sense of humor yeah, along the awesome. way. <laughs> all right, thank you, Joey. Yeah.